Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy V, one and only Prex House, and today we are back with another video. I do apologize for not uploading the past week. Uh, the reason because of this is because my graduation was, uh, you know, graduation week was completely hectic. I had to, like, do a lot of things. I had to make sure everything was prepared. I had to go shopping for clothes, haircuts, uh, meet up with friends, you know, you know, uh, basically what we're going to do after graduation, you know, that kind of stuff. It was an absolute mess. But I do apologize for not streaming or uploading, but I'm going to be back on a regular schedule. I did today get my diploma 626. I got my diploma 625. 2017 was my graduation Sunday, which was yesterday. Today, I'm going to upload this video today, Monday. Um, it was absolutely one hell of a run of four years. Thank you, guys. Literally, thank you all for so much fucking support. I, I've never felt like such, like, people... I did what many people couldn't do. Because these days, when you're walking around, you see people working at McDonald's, fast restaurants, you know, basically people... Most of them don't even have a high school diploma. They just they just have like a, you know, regular, they just want to work and get money. And they live off of that. Um, some people have GEDs, but it's not as good as a high school diploma. A high school diploma is actually when you actually tried the first time and you succeeded the first time. Now, I'm not a lot of you. I did like, I did promise you guys I'm going to do my top 10 high school regrets, but stay tuned for definitely that video is actually going to come up very, 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 very soon. I got all my regrets ready and I'm going to do a complete face cam and maybe I might walk around Times Square or something like that, but I haven't really thought about the actual like, area i'm gonna be while doing this video i haven't really thought about that kind of stuff but i'm thinking about i definitely got the top 10 high school regrets video completely like gathered up i got the i got all the stuff i'm worried about you know that kind of stuff um so everything's been cool friday i didn't saturday i didn't play because i was at a party a graduation party and sunday i went to my graduation today i'm actually home this is my actual only free time right now i'm home and then tomorrow tomorrow i have free time too but wednesday i won't be home so definitely i'll be giving you guys some streams and some gameplays let me know what you guys need now um on the other hand, on my top 10 high school regrets video, I'm going to give you good advice to, for high school. And I'm going to keep, I'm going to tell you the good, the good things about high school and the bad things. I'm not going to fucking sugarcoat anything. I'm going to tell you guys the complete truth about what to expect during a high school experience. Because there's a lot of, I know there's a lot of underage kids who watch my video. You know, some kids I met online and stuff like that. Maybe like graduating 7th grade or something like that. You know, that kind of people. So they, you know, people, the younger audience do watch my video. And then maybe I have some family or friends who like are a little bit younger and they watch my videos. They're just coming into high school. So definitely they can stay tuned for that and they can see what's going on. Um... Everything is going pretty amazing. Like I, I expected everyone to cry during graduation. No one really cried at all. It was just a, it was just a blank thing. Like no one really cared. It was just all good. No one really gave a fuck about life. We just did what we had to do. Got the hell out of there, and then we celebrated. I went to a, a all you can eat Chinese buffet. It was amazing. But I only, I can only, I, when I go to that restaurant, I can never eat more than one plate. It's always like. I eat one plate and my stomach gets full, but people say it's like you gotta slow, gotta save the best for last. Like the rice makes you fucking like full, the uh, the chicken makes you full, and you know that I had these beautiful nice egg rolls, but they're so greasy. I, I kind of regret not eating the whole thing because I I wasted a plate of fucking food to be honest, and I couldn't even get I didn't even get room for dessert. I was so full, and now I regret it because I'm like damn I could have actually ate it. Um, it's been a long run, four years. It's just absolutely amazing. I completed high school, my first run, my first try. And I'm proud of that. I did what most people couldn't do, to be honest. And I hope the people who are watching this video, my friends from, my friends who are actually coming from junior to seniors, and, you know, those type of seniors are graduating this year, you know, well, next year, I do wish you guys the best. I hope you guys make it. Don't give up. Whatever you do, just don't give up. I, I, I'm gonna tell you guys. I'm gonna tell you guys the story, like, when I do my top 10 videos. I don't want to really go too into depth, because I don't want to really, like, waste time. So, like, Basically, I, um, I'm back to uploading regularly as a schedule. I'm doing exactly whatever I can to. I actually haven't uploaded a video in forever. What I usually do is just stream. Like, I don't even upload anymore. So this is actually a very, like, unique situation right now. I was going to do a face cam, but I was like, nah, it's not really worth it right now. The top 10 is going to be way better. But, um, yeah, I haven't also seen Scarce upload for, like, a month. So everyone thought he died. But Scarce, I think he, I believe he quit YouTube because he wasn't getting paid enough. And I think he's actually got a real job. But or maybe something tragically happened to him. God forbid that. But um, yeah, I guess uh, YouTubers these days aren't really uploading as much as they used to before since the new uh, algorithm and the uh, uh, ads and stuff. So if no one ever fucking stitched on the advertisements thing, we, I think YouTube would have still been thriving today. And man, more people would have been making money. But, you know, some guy had to open up his mouth and ruin the chances of people getting advertisements and payments and stuff like that. My video actually, my videos do get uh, advertisements on them. I don't think I really curse as much as I used to before. Well, I do curse. I'm like, fuck. Oh, well. Well, not even advertise, not even put an advertisement on my video. Rest in peace. Whatever, it's not a big deal because I don't really live off YouTube money. I have supporting family, and I'm also gonna start getting a job soon. I'm gonna work, and hopefully, I don't have to worry about YouTube as much as I used to. But I definitely will upload. College life is gonna be a little bit difficult because I don't know how I'm gonna really upload YouTube videos every, you know, from college and stuff like that. I'm gonna try my best to do what I can to give you guys some gameplays. Maybe I might bring, maybe I might dorm into college. I'm not even thinking about that kind of stuff. I might buy like a laptop. Just game from there, play some CSGO, live streams like that, you know, some live comms, and just have some fun. 
because definitely all I do is really live stream. I don't really do videos anymore like I used to. Like back in the day, I used to always do Block Ops 2 videos. Every day I would upload a video and it'd be pretty cool. So what I'm going to do for you guys, I'm going to tell you guys a complete, maybe I might upload the next video. I upload maybe like an hour or maybe like an hour and a half or maybe 45 minutes long because I'm basically going to describe my whole life from high school, like from my life from high school, my life as a YouTuber and what I see myself in the future from like five years from now, you know, that kind of stuff. So that's going to be some personal shit and it's going to be a while. So if you guys, my best, my best, best for you to take my, take your device to the bathroom while you have the newspaper out, forget the newspaper, get the phone and watch my video there. If you're bored, about to go to sleep, can't sleep at night, just watch this video because definitely it will change your life forever. Um. Now, I know, like, uh, I'm not the very, very best YouTuber. My channel really hasn't been growing, but I know a friend of mine who, well, yeah, a good friend of mine, kind of. Uh, we don't really talk as much anymore. We don't even talk anymore, but his name is Pro Hennis. We both have the same amount of subscribers, and now he almost has 80,000 subs just from Black Ops 3 gameplays. And I'm thinking about going back to Call of Duty. I'm not too sure. If you guys want to see Call of Duty, you can let me know. If you guys want to see Counter-Strike, let me know. Maybe I can do a combination of both. Because originally, my channel was supposed to be a Call of Duty channel, but I switched up games every now and then because I got bored of the same content. You know, I get bored of playing the same game over and over, like CSGO. I get bored. I get bored of gaming on PCs after a while. It's just boring. Like, I don't want to play the same game anymore. I have, a, I have like, 420 games, but I only play, like, three games. Matter of fact, I only play one game. I only play CSGO. And CSGO, a Black Ops 3 sometimes with the zombies. And I just play um, Forza Horizon 3. So I only play three games out of 400 fucking games. So you guys should tell me what game I should play. I pretty much have all the games right now. Like, I have all the Call of Duties. I have everything you guys can think of. Like, I have Fallout, Skyrim. You know, just the major games. I can even play Outlast 2 again. I don't mind playing Outlast 2 at a very at a higher difficulty, a harder difficulty. Um, just to see what I can do from there on. Um, but everything's been going cool. Um, you know, people thought I actually something happened because I haven't really been uploading. So people have been commenting like, so you good? I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm on Snapchat. I'm always replying to everyone on Snapchat. I'll always reply to everyone. So if you guys have a question, you can always hit me up there and you can talk to me there. I'll definitely reply to you. Um, so without further ado, I guess I'm new graduate of 2017, senior class of 2017. I'm completely proud of myself. I did amazing. Like I walked across that stage. I was so nervous. Like I, I did it. They said my name. I was like. Yes. Oh my god, my day has come. I'm out of high school. And but only thing that sucks right now is I won't be able to use a free uh, transportation to give you. They give you like a student metro card and you get free rides on it. I won't be getting that anymore. I gotta buy the 30 day unlimited metro cards. And those 30 day unlimited metro cards, oh, they're gonna put a debt in your wallet. Those cost like at least 130 bucks for 30 days unlimited. But that's a good deal because I can pretty much go like anywhere I want to. Like the student metro cards they gave us, you were only able to go around the area. Like in like I live in like let's say like New York. Only a certain part of New York accepts those student metro cards. Uh, every 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 part of New York, every city has different metro cards for the students. But I live in like Westchester County, so my metro is set, has the Westchester County in it, so I can go anywhere that's in Westchester. Um, I couldn't go in the Bronx with those metros. I had to get the so the only metros I can actually use is like the uh, yellow metro. It just says it just says metro card. Those are, those can be used on any buses, any subway. So basically, I can go to Times Square every day, twenty four seven, if I really really desire to, if I wanted to with the thirty unlimited metro card. And that's my intentions. I'm actually gonna go out all the time. If I have a thirty unlimited metro, I'm going out every single day to the stores. I'm not coming home to like late. Hell no, I got no business hanging out home. You know, I might do vlogs out there. I'm gonna have so much fun just doing what I gotta do to enjoy myself out there because I'm growing up. I'm gonna basically, I'm basically an adult right now, and that's pretty much how I desire things right now. Um, yeah, everything's just. Uh, I kind of wish my sister the best too. I want my sister to do better than me. I want her to go for advanced regions. I want her to get scholarships. You always want the best for your family members. You, you did good, but I want the best for her because I think she has a way better opportunity than me. If I have kids one day, I'm going to make sure they get scholarships. They get high grades. I don't want them playing no video games on weekdays. I'm going to do that kind of shit because my mom did that, but I, I regret it because I thought I if I didn't do, if I studied a lot more, I could have been high on. I could have been on honor roll principal's list. I could have got scholarships to many schools and I would have had a nice GP. I would have been very well educated. I'm not saying I'm not educated, but I am. But like, I, if, I, if I didn't play video games as much as I used to, I think I'd be better as an educator. I'd be way better. Um, everything would be cool. And, you know, I just, I'd be more social. If I, if I didn't play video games as much, I'd be more social. Like this year, I kind of regret it because I wasn't as social as I was. Like, I was so, I became like, I came out of my shell the last fucking like, like three months of school i came out my shell i was being invited to more parties i was having fun i was hanging out with friends i didn't really play as much video games as i used to so you guys may notice that if you guys look at my steam profile i only have like maybe 10 hours past the week so maybe like 11 because i barely played i barely play anymore i like to go out hang out with friends i like to socialize i like to make friends that's what i like to do i was always the quiet kid in the classroom and i wouldn't really speak to anyone until i came out my shell sorry you know talking i was very nervous i was very scared but now i realized just don't give a fuck about your just don't give a fuck about anything just do what you gotta do and eventually you'll get there 
um but i hope you guys did enjoy this video and if you guys did please leave a thumbs up and that will actually help and subscribe if you haven't because definitely that's gonna help my numbers i really want to get to 10k my dream was to get 10k before school ended but i couldn't do it but maybe at the end of this year i can definitely do it but hope you guys enjoy this video and if you guys did please leave a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't i'll see you guys later peace out